going down one of these rather steep trails to get to our access point. You can see how rough that terrain is. Just across to the right, you might be able to see, is a very ancient pathway. Now, these pathways were constructed by the early miners. And you can see that one there is crossing the gully. And this one even has the wooden posts intact. Now, I can't give you a date on that construction, but uh, it looks pretty ancient. That's a very lot of uh, labour, intensive work there. You can see the old post. If I just sort of zoom in on that. And all those rocks sort of put there by hand. Now, as that bridge spanned across this creek here, there's another post. And we can see it right there. And there's the hole with the old wire coming out of it. Now, you can see that that post has fallen over. Interestingly, not a cut post, but it looks like at one stage it was a tree in the ground because the root system is still there. There we are, we can see that root system. So very old indeed, that sort of technology there. And you can see where that wire comes out of that post. And it comes out here again. All part of the same bridge, but that at one stage, I believe, was a tree in the ground. Get as much out as we can make it worthwhile as gold seeks its way to the bottom of any crack and crevice and it's got to be on a hard surface otherwise it's going to work its way right into the into the soil and way down deep. So this is what we're after here. There we go. Bit of a pan full, we want to get all that mud and clay out of there. Because this is called puddling. Very labour intensive kind of work. You give it a bit of a swirl and get that heavy stuff to the bottom. Chip off the mud. Yeah. I can't see any big nuggets staring at me there so we're going to just scrape. Maybe out a few nuggets. A bit more panning. This water is a bit muddy because of the dust. So it's not actually giving us a very clear angle on the um, on what we're looking for. So keep painting that off. And you want to get it down to a fine slurry there. And keep working away on that. And we'll see what we can find. Okay, let's have a bit of a look. See what we've got in there. There are a couple of specks of gold in this first assay that I've commenced. Um, they're pretty hard to see. I'm going to let them go back into the stream because I'm only picking out the larger ones that I can hear rattle in my ear. Um, I'll just see if I can zoom in and show you this speck. Well, yes, it is very hard to see it and identify it with the rest, but that there is a speck of gold. Um, it looks like every other speck in the pan, but it's pretty hard to tell it. Well, we've actually now got something of a dilemma. Uh, I want to get across the bank and up that track over there. But um, because the stream has risen so high, uh, I'm finding it difficult to get across. So, I'm going to film live. A rock hop. I've got to jump onto that rock and not fall in. So I'm holding the camera. So here we go. One, two, three. We made it. Woo. Almost lost the camera. That's where I come from. That was risky.